Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How to get power of attorney for incapacitated spouse? Power of attorney is a legal document that allows one person to make decisions on behalf of another. This is especially important when a spouse becomes incapacitated. To initiate the process, it is essential to determine the type of power of attorney needed. A durable power of attorney remains effective even when the principal becomes incapacitated. Next, you must assess your spouse's mental competency. A doctor may need to evaluate your spouse to confirm their incapacity. This is a crucial step in the process. Once incapacity is established, you can begin drafting the power of attorney document. It is advisable to consult an attorney to ensure that the document complies with state laws. The document should specify the powers granted to you. These can include financial matters, healthcare decisions, or both. Clarity in the document is essential to avoid confusion later. After drafting, the power of attorney must be signed and notarized. Some states may require witnesses to sign the document as well. Following these steps, you should file the document with relevant institutions, such as banks or healthcare providers. This ensures they recognize your authority to act on behalf of your spouse. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.